Medway. Mario Grand Prix. Select your player. Yahoo! Yee! Select man! Okay! Good morning, Medway. It's Friday, October 6th, and I'm Michael. And I'm Steven, and welcome to another edition of MTV, live from Medway TV Studios. So tell me, Steven, what's with the cowboy hat today? Well, I'm pretty excited about the upcoming Medway play, Way Out West in a Dress. You are? Well, me too, Steven. It was a beautiful day for the cross-country meet yesterday at the Weirder Station Invitational. Congrats to the junior girls team at Clarissa Slidick. Amara Pratt. Lila Pratt. Faith Cringen, Sarah Cringen, Ashley Jeffries, and Grace Jones, who took first overall as a team. The performance of the day was put on by Clarissa Sladek, who convincingly won the junior girls race. A reminder to all runners that hoodie orders are due today to Mr. Hambly. Now here's some information about the upcoming Terry Fox Run. Hey Medway, I'm here with the CEO of Terry Fox Run, Ben Horvat. So um, when is the Terry Fox Run? Uh, the Terry Fox Run this year is on October 12th. And it's going to be a fourth period. So who can participate in this Terry Fox walk? So basically everyone in the school can um, participate in this on October 12th. How can we as students help this Terry Fox walk? So um, all students can bring in a toonie for their fourth period class. And uh, so toonie for Terry. And if we all bring in a toonie, we can hopefully raise our goal, which was uh, $2,500 this year. Where does the money go to? Uh, so the money this year, like always, goes to the uh, Terry Fox Foundation for cancer research. So Ben, where's the Terry Fox walk? Um, so it's held in Weldon Park. Um, we're going to be starting in the gym and SAA is going to be giving a brief presentation about Terry Fox. And then we're all going to leave and go for a walk around Weldon Park. So what happens if you bring the most amount of tunies in fourth period class? So the department that brings in the most tunies, um, all the classes in fourth period will win a special prize. Mystery. The junior football team had a strong opponent yesterday when they traveled to Oak Ridge to play the Oaks. In spite of their loss, our offense moved the ball well and our linebacker shut down the Oaks running game. Next week, we play East Elgin here at Medway. Tryouts for Reach for the Top continue this week and next, after school in the science wing. Junior tryouts are tonight, Tuesday and Wednesdays. Senior tryouts are Thursday and Friday of next week. All are welcome. See Mr. Boyd, Miss Antini, or Miss Shaw for more information. Attention all students in grade 10, 11, and 12. The 2016-17 yearbooks were handed out in period 4 yesterday. If you were absent yesterday, please pick up your yearbook from your period 4 teacher. If you are in grade 12 and have a spare or if you have any questions about the 2016-2017 yearbook, please come to room 218 to speak with Ms. Timmel at the start of period 2. The Languages Department is having a trip to Spain in the March break. Would you like to go? Here's some more information. Ore, chico! Si, tu. Te gustan tapas? Te gustan las ciudades bonitas? Y te gusta flamenco? Ven a España! Ahora estamos aquí con señora Laird y uh, voy a hablar con uh, el viaje de España. ¿Por qué los estudiantes van a, a España? Van a visitar muchos lugares bonitos. Vamos a visitar Madrid, Barcelona, eh, Málaga, Sevilla, Granada. Ah, bueno, ¿quiénes pueden ir a España? Cualquier estudiante que en grado 11 o grado 12. ¿Cuándo es el viaje? El viaje es en marzo, del 8 a 18 de marzo. ¿Y cuánto cuesta? Cuesta bastante, cuesta $3,200 dólares. Regresamos a ustedes, MTV. Do you have a desire to change the world, discuss and act on global issues, even change the Medway culture? 
Have you ever heard of WE.org? WE is a movement that brings people together and gives them the tools to change the world. Today, we are millions of passionate youth, women, and men working together to shift the world from me to we. If you would like to start the WE movement at Medway, please see Miss Douglas at room 225 at lunch today. Now, here's a message from Medway's Healthy Foods Committee. Exactly where you're gonna start to start having a better breakfast. Oh, uh, how? It started by picking up free food at the guidance office, like apples and oranges, bagels and bread. But hey, that's pretty good. Wow, Don, that sounds great and all, but the morning's almost over. Did I miss my chance to get such amazing nutrition? No. So it's always open. You'll never miss your chance to fill yourself up. It's great, but it's not even the best part. The best part is... It's free food. Yes! Free food in the guidance office. Makerspaces is taking place today during both lunches in the library conference room. Everyone is welcome. Bring your lunch. Next week, university presentations will be taking place in the main library for senior students. Please check the library doors for dates and times that the library is booked. The library will be closed after school on Tuesday and Thursday next week. Sorry for the inconvenience. Medway is having an exposition football game to raise money for the Terry Fox Foundation. Here's some more information. Oh, we out here talking about Powder Puff. Hey Kenzie, what is Powder Puff? Powder Puff is a girls flag football tournament to raise money for breast cancer. Hey Melo, so when is Powder Puff? Powder Puff will be on Wednesday, October 11th, and the rain day will be Friday the 13th. Here's a few rules. Rule number one, no contact. In flag football, you pull off your opponent's tag to make the tackle. To score a point, bring the ball into the end zone. Hey Cass, so uh, how long are the games? 15 minutes. Where are they going to be played? On the big football field. So uh, is there anything else you want to tell the people? Players and spectators wear pink in support of breast cancer. Could Elise Drollude and Winterberg please come to the main office after these announcements? Did you lose an iPod? See the main office. Last week, Medway students and staff participated in the CIBC Run for the Cure in downtown London. Jaweed reports. Hey Medway, it's your boy Jaweed here and we're here talking about the CIBC Run for the Cure. When was it? The race took place on Sunday, October 1st at Victoria Park. What was the main purpose of the run? So the purpose of the CIBC Run for the Cure is to raise money for breast cancer research as well as support breast cancer patients. Where do the proceeds go to? The proceeds go to the Canadian Cancer Society. Do you know how much was raised? Uh, so Medway raised a total of $1,853. London raised a total of $170,000. In Canada raised a total of $17 million. Amazing. Who took part in the run? So the Medway Cowboys team had a total of 15 uh, student and staff runners. And 85,000 people ran the race nationwide. I've noticed this in your hands. Can you tell me what it is? It's the School Team Challenge Award, and it's given to the top fundraising school team in London. Nice. Back to you, MTV. Well, that's all your announcements for today, Medway. Have a great weekend, and thanks for tuning in to Medway TV.